What's up, Cash Cannon Box? What's up, my Cash Cannon Box? Look, we are back for a short, short, quick second. For a short, quick second. I mean, short, because I got to get the hell up out of here, because I got to go back and take care of somebody real quick. But, um, I was just on Houston Bread's channel, and, you know, they talking about relationships and stuff. And, um, something stuck, stuck out to me, you know. And uh, I believe she said something about the ocean. You know, you are the, I think she said, you are the, you are your own, you are the ocean. Well, I asked for a cup of water from somebody, you know. And, um, and I'm gonna say that's for the, for an example. That's just well, that's just an analogy. But it's just like, um, why why go out the way to get somebody attention, you know, or beg for somebody attention when it shouldn't be like that, you know. And I'm gonna just say like this. I've been going through that with somebody for some years, for some years. You know, I met this person at 23, and I'm 29 now. So it's just like it's an ongoing pattern. I didn't got to the point where. I'm ready to get off the tracks because <laughs> you know I just it's not a good feeling when you feel like you know is it something that I'm doing or was or is it something that you're doing that you liking and you just want to have me out here like this and that and thinking that you can call and come back you know anytime and I, and I got to the play I got to the point where I'm just ready to just say hey we don't have to be we don't have to see each other no more you know I I don't know why I have to call, remind people to call me I should have to remind people to call me. You know, if you want to say, if you want to fuck around with me, you fuck around with me. You know what I'm saying? You you, call, you can hit me up and call me, come see me. But all of this one wanted me to come out and chase, chase you and wonder why I ain't called you. No, that's bullshit. Because I already know. I done dealt with that shit with this person umpteen times. Umpteen times. You know what I'm saying? And now I'm just like at the place right now where ain't no more tears. Ain't no more tears. Ain't no more calling. Ain't no more begging. I'm not begging to see anybody. Especially right now. I'm not begging to see anybody. If you don't, if you want to see me, you better hit me up. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that. You know, if you want to see me or want me around you, you hit me up. Because you know what? I have always been the person to reach out to motherfuckers and motherfuckers to take their time to reach out to me. But when it comes to their friends and their family, oh, they just quit the thing, you know, to pick up the phone and dial for them. But when it comes for me, oh, no, when it comes to me, I can barely get a hi or a hello. You know what I'm saying? So that's like, I'm backing up. I'm backing up. It's like, I don't even really, I'm kind of getting to the point where I just want to just, you know, just cut this shit loose. You know, but it's not so easy to do when you have had love for this person. And I feel like I was in love with this person, but now I kind of feel out of that because I'm still seeing, you know, the pattern. And it just, when you see the pattern over and over again, it's like, damn, maybe I don't need to be feeling certain type of ways about you because maybe you ain't feeling me, feel, maybe, you ain't, you're, maybe you're not feeling me like that, like you say, you know what I'm saying? I remember one time this person told me they didn't love me. Now they said it now. Well, they, they, they said that in the past, but now in the present they're saying they love me now. But I kind of don't even, it don't even seem believable. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not seeing, I haven't seen any change. You know? And I refuse to cry. You know, that's why I'm, that's why I'm on here right now talking about it. Because I refuse to have, let somebody have so much of power and control over my emotions. And how, and my, and my morals and my values. Because I know I deserve better. And you know, I'm still, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a work in prog progress, you know what I'm saying, I'm trying to decide what I should really do, because I done got to the point where I'm getting, um, I'm getting uninterested, you know what I'm saying, it's crazy, because I've just been, I've been around this person for a long time, you know, the, he, this person's probably the longest person that stuck around since I done got off the porch in this community, in the LGB, all that, you know, this person was the only person that stuck around, everybody else left me. Everybody, I'm so used to people leaving so quick. It's like a one night stand. It's like, wow, really, for real, what happened? What, what did I do? I don't know if it was the liquor, I don't know if it's the weed, I don't know if it's because I don't have my own car, house, you know, I don't know. Or, they, or, if, it's, or if it's about my job, you know. But they all left. But, he, that, but, this, but this person that I was with for some, that for some years, they stayed. Stayed around. And I know, one for them, I know, I know it wasn't because of the sex. Because... We done have plenty of deep talks, <laughs> and and I really feel like you know if, I, if it was about the sex, you know, I wouldn't be emotionally and physically attracted, <laughs> you know, you know, to that person, to this person, that or not the one I, that I'm kind of semi dating, you know, because and, and the reason why I say that because we really we, me and this person we really haven't made it official, 
You just kind of just been going along with the flow. But going along with the flow, don't it's not always a good thing because sometimes someone's gonna be liking the other a lot more than the person is. That well, if someone's gonna someone's gonna be in a relate. I feel like someone's gonna like the other more than the than, than the person gonna be like well then them them they, uh, how can I explain it? Then them liking them a little, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like uh <laughs> I don't got to that place where I'm just just kind of done a little bit. I'm just kind of done. I kind of don't even or I don't even have the energy to even pick up my phone. <laughs> to even try to reach out to anybody, you know what I'm saying? Because, well, to reach out to this person, because I just feel like that's, that's it sucks, you know, it sucks. Because you know, when your family call, the friends call, they're quick to answer that, or quick to um, answer that text or call. But when it comes to me, tuh, it's like whenever, 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 or whenever I hit you, and it's like, wow, really? But when I don't, but when I do that to them, uh, what I'm doing? Where you are? You dead? You know, it's like, no, I'm still here. You know, but I'm just, I done got to a place where I'm kind of just fed up with the bullshit and I'm just letting some, I'm just kind of want to go back out there because I'm still got, still in my 20s, you know, and just give somebody else a chance, you know, but I'm going to take it a little slow. It ain't going to be so fucking fast like the first, like, like it was with this person, you know, but, um, yeah, I'm just kind of wiping my hands. I'm, I'm, I'm almost ready to wipe my hands for certain shit, you know, wipe my hands for certain shit and just be done you know because it's just who want to be i'm not gonna be crying and i'm not gonna be begging nobody for no to come around me if you want to see me you can come see me if not stay where you at you know stay whoever making you i want you to be happy. whoever is whoever is whoever, whoever is making you happy i want you to be with them you ain't got to be with me you know what i'm saying you don't got to be with me you don't because i this because I, honestly this go for two people that i'm talking to you ain't gotta be with me because i don't I, I don't look I'm not a whore, but I do. I have, I have. You know, you can date two people because you're single. I'm single. I can date two people, but it's just um, when it comes to <clears throat> a party one and party two, psh, baby, it's like they're going right through to the ones to, to the bottom of I don't give a fuck about you anymore. And I'm getting to that place where I, I'm not giving a fuck anymore. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let you be what yeah. But I don't have to, you know, I don't have to continue to give you an ounce of my attention. Because I'm already fed up with the bullshit. You know, how it's, I get so many DMs and messages off of apps from different people. And I, I turn them down. Just for these two motherfuckers. Turn them down. You know what I'm saying? Have I stepped out? Yeah, I have. Because I wasn't getting sexually pleased. But far than, other than that, I ain't trying to be with them motherfuckers here. But you know what? I do want to say this too. If I was, and I want to say this to this one other person out here. If it was really, if it was lust, I wouldn't, if it was lust, I would have been let you go a long time ago. A long time ago, like them, like, like them other motherfuckers, did, you know, did. Well, well, did me and I did them, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of times, I can meet motherfuckers and they, they just, bam, it's like one night stand, bam, 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 they gone. You know, so it's like, damn, it was, is it because of my situation, you know, because I don't drive, because I got a, a little fear of that. And, and then my job situation, you know, they may not, they may not feel like I make enough money or the fact that I stay with family, you know. All those, it's just, just things, you know, it's just like, I got questions, you know, shout out to W, shout out to Deanna, WGQs, I got questions, let me know what it is, you know what I'm saying, woo wee, but yeah, I'm just, your boy is done, <laughs> I'm getting to that place and just cut all this shit off, but I maybe should, maybe I should start going back dating women or something, because you know, I see what, I see what, a, what, I see what, I see what women mean when they, when they have to go through this with black men, and well really any man, because it don't matter what color they are. Cause a man gonna be a man, but I see why women call men the names that they call them. Mm -hmm. And they do the things that they do to them because of what they how they do to you and how they come off to you. You know what I'm saying? And it's all about having some morals and values by yourself. And I really should. I really wish I would never let that stuff go on so for so long. But baby, <laughs> it won't be going long. It won't be going long. It won't be going. It won't be going long. It won't be going. It won't be. It won't be going. Um. Along like, well, how can I can I can't even say it all right, all the all the way right. Oh my goodness, it won't be going, it, it won't be going, going, going too long, cause um, hey, I didn't got to, I didn't got to the place. I'm not taking no more shit. I'm not, and um, I had to get this out. That's probably why I'm messing up on my words, but I'm just not taking no more shit. I'm done with that. I'm done. And if they can't understand that, I don't know what else to tell them. You know. 
Shit, they older than me, 10 years. I think one of them, maybe a little bit more. The guy. But, um, yeah. I'm just, I'm not finna take care of, I'm not finna be babysitting grown, grown ass me. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Y'all you, you, you can do that, but I'm not doing that. I'm not finna be that. I'm not finna be that. Because, for one, you're older than me. Okay, you're older than me, you know more than me, you see more than me. So, bam, okay, you got, you got me, you got me up on that. But when it comes to all the communication, you should be know how to communicate with somebody. Because I'm sure you could be able to communicate with your friends and your family. But when it comes to somebody that you want to fuck around with, you can't communicate with them motherfucking asses. That's a problem. That's a big problem to me. And that, and that problem, if that, that, that problem don't get solved, baby, it's going to get a, you're going to get a flat out, fuck you. Yeah. I was going to say if, but fuck you. Yeah. That's, and that's how it's going to be. You know, and I'm sweating as fuck, and I'm like, I might have to take this shirt off because boy, it's hot as fuck. But um, yeah, I'm 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 at that place right now, and I had to get this shirt out because it kind of triggered, <laughs> triggered something on the inside. But um, it's all right though, cause I got somebody on the, on the other line. Oh my goodness, who the fuck is this pulling up over here? I don't know who the fuck this is. But it kind of triggers me. It's trying to it's kind of triggered me or well, triggered something on the inside. But it's okay though, cause um. Whatever happens, happens, and it just it just God showing me that you may you may not need to take that. You gotta let them know it's a wrap. And on that note, you guys, I will talk to you guys later on, and um, I'll be um, I'll be gone along my own out of here. Peace, peace out, you guys. Oh, I had to get that out.